At one time or another, a lot of us have been in this situation. You're in a store, you badly need to use the restroom, but you're told there is none for the public. No matter how much pressure you're under, the answer is no. But Alex Tomlin reports, blessed relief may soon be in sight for at least some people. When you gotta go, you gotta go. And Representative Tom Anderson says some people should be allowed to use a store's private bathroom when they need to go. He's introduced a bill that would allow people with certain medical conditions to carry a bathroom card. It basically means a store with a private bathroom can't turn those people away. You can't stop them from, it's a natural thing, you gotta let them use a the bathroom. Dory Martin owns Purple Pink Rhino in Knob Hill. She says a private bathroom is bad for business. It's not a good idea for people to leave the store because they usually don't come back. But just down the street, Tres Boutique owner Suzanne Garcia says most of her clients are understanding. And they're always understanding. They'll ask if it's public or private, and they're fine with it normally. Garcia says her bathroom isn't made for a lot of traffic. It's a small space in our back room, and um, it's not really for public access. She is concerned the cramped space is dangerous and someone could trip heading to the bathroom. The bill does say a store could refuse someone if there's a danger or if merchandise is close by and could be stolen easily. Other people in Knob Hill worry some may take advantage of the bill and cause a headache for store owners. Oftentimes you're going to have to defend yourself against people that are going to use it for unscrupulous reasons. To get a card, you would need a doctor's note and you could get a temporary card if you have a short-term medical issue. Dick? All right, Alex, if that bill passes, refusing to let someone with a card use the bathroom would be a misdemeanor crime.